Hi, my name is Don Lobo. I'm the founder of Project Tech for Dev and Glyphic, the organization that is applying for a grant. I was an early employee of Yahoo uh, and helped lead engineering for multiple uh, disciplines. Uh, as among one of the many things that I did, I also helped um, convince the founders to start the Yahoo Employee Foundation, primarily because um, of my deep conviction that there is an important role to play with regard at, at, the, at the intersection of open source technology uh, platforms and nonprofits. Um, 15 years ago, after my Yahoo career, I started an open source project called Civi CRM, which helps the nonprofit sector manage constituents and databases. Um, Civi CRM is a fairly big success right now. It's used by more than 10,000 organizations around the world, including Wikimedia Foundation, Electronic Frontier Foundation, Free Software Foundation, and others. Um, as part of my work for this project, I also got the Antonio Pizzicati Prize for Software in the Public Interest. Approximately eight months ago, we decided to start Project Glyphic uh, so that we could better serve uh, the developing world, uh, primarily countries in Southeast Asia, Africa, and Latin America. Today, our focus is on India with a uh, project with, with Glyphic. Uh, COVID illustrated the fact that we really need to strengthen the last mile connectivity between NGOs and social sector organizations and, and the beneficiaries that they are working to improve their lives on. Which, and by scale, we mean like 1,000 plus beneficiaries or so. Today, Glyphic operates uh, using WhatsApp Business API, but in future, we'd love to have it work with Signal, uh, Telegram, and other communication platforms. Um, in addition to building a platform that can service multiple NGOs, we also want to build an ecosystem where these NGOs can help each other and help grow the ecosystem and also sustain it. Uh, the goal for Glyphic is to uh, collect and make enough money operationally so that our operational fees are covered. Yeah, thank you for listening. And if you have any questions, please feel free to send us email um, 